new topic. I am Sarim Khan studying in 5th standard and today I am going to start class 11th NCRT Mathematics. So this is my first video over NCRT Mathematics of class 11. So today I am going to solve the first chapter exercise 1.1 and question number first. Okay so today we are going to solve the question number first. So first before solving question number first let me tell you what is set. So let me tell you that set we can call any collection of any means of anything of any object set and if the objects if the elements present in that collection are well defined just like the collection of all the collection of any well defined object numbers or terms is a set okay just like all collections are not sets okay there are many collections which are not set okay but means whichever collections okay whichever collections of anything okay of any terms which are well defined okay any term is present which is well defined in any collection so that whole collection becomes a set okay so the question number first is which of the following are sets justify your answer so here we have to justify that which of them are sets okay some collections are have been given to us we have to tell that whether they are sets or not we have to write that yes or in yes or no so the first is the collection of all months of the year of a year beginning with letter J. So here, here it is asking the collection of all the months of a year beginning with letter J. So here we have to focus over all the months of year. Okay, whose means whose total word in total word the first letter is J. So just like January we have, June we have, July we have. So first letter is J here. It's, it's this whole month is beginning with letter J. So so here its collection is given so all January June July they all are well defined from the person to person distributed over the whole world they cannot vary if they are if you ask to me about those about all the means all the months of a year beginning with letter J I'll also tell same and if you ask to any other person he will also tell the same so it may not vary from person to person this is why it is yes a set Okay, so we can write yes here, it is a set. Next is the collection of 10 most talented writers of India. So let me tell you, it is not a set. Why it is not a set? Okay, okay, so let me reply about the question that actually here 10 most talented writers of India. Okay, it may vary from person to person. I may say that Dr. Kalam is greatest writer of India. You may say that H.C. Verma is greatest writer of India. Okay, so here it may vary from person to person. So this is why it may vary from person to person for our 10 most talented writers of India and if it may vary means it uh, this collection its terms are not well defined and if they are not well defined so this collection is not a set so here we can write no so now the next is a team of 11 best cricket batsmen of the world. So here it is asking miss the team of 11 best cricket batsmen of the world. So this is also not a set. Why? Because actually here I may say that Virat is the best cricket batsman of the whole world. You may say Dhoni is and anyone else will say about anyone else. So this may also vary. So this is why if it may vary so it is not a set. Okay. Here it is given it is not a set now the now the collection of all boys of your class so here this is a set why it is a set because actually here we can notice one thing that actually here oh miss if of my class anyone asks to me the collection of all boys so whatever I will tell whatever list I will give for this collection whatever elements will be those elements will be same if you ask to any boy of my own class okay I will also tell the same number same list and he will also also tell the same list so this is yeah of course a set okay so this is a set next is the collection of all natural numbers less than 100 natural numbers we know 1 2 3 4 5 6 all counting numbers are called natural numbers so here less than 100 means 1 2 3 4 up to 100 it will go okay and if it okay because it is given less than 100 so if I if you ask to me that what um, that the collection of about the collection of all natural numbers less than 100 whatever I will tell okay from 1 to 100 okay simple any other 
person will also give the same list. So this is why we can call this collection set because all elements are same for every person living in this world distributed over this world. So here means if the elements present in this are well defined and if they are well defined so this collection may be called as a set. So here we can write it. Yes. Now here a collection of all all novels written by writer Munshi uh, Munshi Premchand. So here we can say that all novels written by Munshi Premchand. So here Govdan. Uh, if we say about Govdan, if we say about any other novel written by Munshi Premchand, okay, Gaban, and like this all other novels, okay. So like this, just like if you ask to me about all novels written by right, this writer and if you ask to any other person about all novels written by this writer so we'll tell the same as well and this is why it means that the all novels written by Munshi Premchan okay it is same for every person okay distributed over this whole world so it means this collection in this collection this whichever elements are present those are the same okay it means those are well defined and this why this collection is a set Okay, so here we can write yes. Now the next is collection of all even integers. So here it is asking about even integers. Okay, collection of all even integers, whether that is two, four, six, eight. You ask to me that uh, what are the collection of all int even integers? So from two, four, six, eight, ten. Later it will go up to infinity. And here this collection of uh, all even integers will be same if you ask to me and any other person. So we'll give the same answer. Okay, from two to uh, our infinity okay so this is if this uh, means we can call it as a set because this collection because actually this collection all terms are well defined so this is also a set okay so this is a set next is okay that is question number eight the the collection of questions in this chapter now here we have class 11th ncrt mathematics chapter sets okay now in this chapter whichever okay whichever means questions are if you ask to me i will also give same list if you ask to, and to any other person who is studying in class 11th and is studying this book of class 11th ncrt mathematics and who has studied this chapter sets so he will also give, give same list of questions so means uh, for me and him it is same and have any person living on this earth will give the same list it means it means whichever terms in this collection are given okay whichever questions whichever terms in this collection are given those are same for everyone this doesn't vary and we can call that actually those all, all terms are well defined so it is also said now the next and the last means question number ninth is a collection of most dangerous animals of the world so here this is not a set because it may vary from person to person i may say king cobra is the most dangerous animal living on the whole earth and you may say that the poison arrow frog is the most dangerous animal living on the whole world so it may vary from person to person according to their fear and that to which animal they are most fear okay they are for them they are most dangerous animals living on the world so and so according to this we get it that the elements in this collection okay are not same for everyone means they are not well defined and if they are not well defined so this is not a sin so this was my today's topic please like and subscribe thank you